So if you have two horse brushes, one that costs $30 and one that costs $15, you would think the brush that costs $30 would be better than the $15 brush, right? But that's not always the case. And I found four different horse brushes that work wonderfully well and they all cost less than $20. And that's what I'm gonna share with you today. Hello, my equestrian friends. It's me, Lisa, the budget equestrian. Welcome back to another video. And like I said in the beginning, there are so many different horse brushes available today. Some of them cost a couple of dollars all the way up to $75, $100. And I don't know about you, but I really don't have the budget for a $100 horse brush. But I have tried out a lot of different horse brushes, and I would kind of think that makes me an expert on horse brushes. Well, maybe not an expert on horse brushes, but definitely someone who has a lot of experience trying out different horse brushes and grooming equipment for that matter, which means I can give you an honest opinion of which horse brushes really perform the best to get your horse super clean and shiny. And that way you don't have to go out and buy the brushes. Just watch this video and you can see the brushes in action and see what you think. So in no particular order, here are the best horse brushes that you can find under $20. So the first brush is the Decker number no. 95 brush. It's called the blue ribbon brush. And the description says the bristles are a medium soft bristle. But in my experience, I would say that they are more kind of run on the stiff end. But this is a fantastic and sturdy brush that I use every day on my horses. The dirt doesn't stick to the bristles and it really helps to remove the sweat marks, slobber marks, and dirt from your horse's coat. Like I said, it's a really sturdy brush. It fits great into your hand and it's really affordable. Jeffers Equine has this very brush for $5.49 and that is a fantastic deal on a horse brush. This Decker brush is very sturdy. It's going to last a long time, easy to clean and it really helps to get your horse nice and clean without a lot of work on your part. Brush number two is the Winter Circle Flick Brush. Now, even though it's a flick brush, I would consider the bristles to be more of a medium, so I would say this would be like the second brush that I use when I'm grooming. It's a really durable brush. It has a nice wooden back, and it fits nicely into your hand. It does seem like it gets a little bit of the deeper dirt out of my horse's coat, and it works really well on their legs too. It does work well as a flick brush, but again, I have another brush that I like for my flick brush, but this one works pretty well too. But I really like this as just a general purpose grooming brush that I can grab and use whenever I feel the need to brush my horses. Now this brush, I've tried to find it online, but the only place that I can find it is at Dover's and it runs about $13.95. To me, that seems like a pretty fair price for a brush like this, and I am really happy that I got it, and I think you will be too if you decided to buy it. Now, the third brush that I wanted to talk to you about is by Tail Tamer, and it is the Tail Tamer Small Flick Brush. Okay, and to be honest, this was a impulse buy when I went to Murdoch's to get some horse feed. I saw the colors, and I just really liked it, so I was like, yeah, I think I'm going to have to buy this. When I bought it at Murdoch's, it was $10, and that seems pretty middle of the road pricing for what this type of brush is. Now, I would consider this brush to be a flick brush. It's a softer brush, and it really does work great to flick that loose hair and dirt off of your horse's coat. And it comes in a lot of different fun colors. It's easily washable, and the back of the brush has like a rubberized grip, so it makes it easy for you to hold on to it when you're flicking that hair off of your horse's coat. Like I said, I found this brush at Murdoch's and it was around $10. I did find it on Amazon for $13.95 and it does come in several different colors. And the last brush that I wanted to share with you is probably one of my most favorite brushes that I've ever bought. And it is the Haas Diamond Gloss Horse Hair Soft Body Brush. That's a mouthful, isn't it? <laughs> and like I said, this is like my favorite brush to use when I'm at the end of my grooming. So this would be considered a finishing brush. 
it's really great for getting rid of that fine dust and the dandruff that can sometimes get on our horses. It has super dense natural horsehair bristles and it has a really nice leather hand strap for you to put your hand in, which makes it even easier to use. Now the bristles are directly incorporated into the body of the brush, which means the bristles are gonna stay where they're supposed to and not get loose and fall out. And this brush will make your horse so shiny. Like I said, it really makes a great finishing brush. And even though it's on the high end of horse brushes less than $20, in my opinion, it's definitely worth it to add to your grooming kit. I got my Haas Diamond Gloss Brush from Riding Warehouse and it is $19.95. So as far as brushes go for your grooming kit, I think if you had these four brushes or four brushes similar to that, you'd be pretty good to go. The other two things that I would probably add would be, of course, a hoof pick. And I like the hoof picks with the brush on the end as well. And then of course, you're gonna need a curry comb and a curry comb, I don't know why they call it a curry comb because it's kind of like a curry brush, but the curry comb is great for really massaging into your horse. And also you can use it to get the dirt and dust out of your brushes while you're grooming your horse. The curry comb that I have is by Decker and it has a web hand strap. So it's really comfortable to wear while you're grooming or currying your horse or even knocking the dirt out of your brushes. And it runs about $5. So that's a really good deal. And just in case you wanted to check out any of the brushes that I talked about in this video, I have left links down in the description box below so you can go check them out for yourself and see what you think. Hopefully this gives you a little bit more information on each of these type of brushes, a lot more so than if you were to go to an ad and look at the description. This way you can actually see the brushes in use, see how shiny they make my horse, and then you can decide if this would be something right for you and your horse. Thank you so much for taking time out of your day to watch this video. Be sure to subscribe to my channel so you can watch all my other DIY projects, product reviews, and horse related videos showing you how to make the most of the time that you have with your horse. Again, thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.